I intended for this vlog to be about me eating keto and losing weight and getting strong and healthy and then just showing my amazing results. And hopefully in the end that's the way it's going to turn out, but it feels like I'm on a different course. I had a PET scan and I haven't done a vlog in a long time because of that. I had a really hard time dealing with it. It said that I either have, well, probably either have um, lymphoma, which is a form of cancer, or sarcoidosis, which is an autoimmune disease, or something called Castleman's disease, which is not cancer. I'm not really sure what it is, but the mortality rate is pretty bad, so I'm hoping I really don't have that. Um, I have adenopathy, which means my lymph nodes are larger than they should be. In fact, they are so large in my chest that they take up room that is supposed to be taken by my lungs. And I have granulomas in my lungs. And um, my lungs are pretty efficient though. Every time they check my oxygen saturation, it's normal. So way to go lungs, yeah. And so I have the adenopathy. It starts up here in my, the lower part of my neck. And it goes all down through my chest and it's off in my lungs. And it's down by my liver and down in my hips. So all of those lymph nodes are big. And usually lymph nodes are part of your immune system. They fight disease. And when they get big, it usually means you're sick. That's why when you go to the doctor, they push on here. And actually this one feels a little big, but I have a staph infection in the sinus. So yeah, that's another thing. I took three weeks of an antibiotic and when I went back to the doctor to have it checked out again, he said, oh my goodness, that staph infection's worse than it was a month ago. So now I have a new antibiotic that I squirt up my nose and rinse out my sinuses. On Thursday, I am going to have a mediastinoscopy. What that means is that they're going to cut a little hole here in my throat and put a scope down in between my sternum, which is that bone in the middle of your chest, and then my trachea, which is the, um, yeah, that's the tube that you breathe through. So in your throat, you have two tubes, one's for eating, one's for breathing. So I guess the breathing one is more up front. And so the scope goes in between the breathing tube and the breastbone. And it, they're gonna go down. They're gonna take chunks out of the lymph nodes um, and then they're going to test them right there while I'm on the table to make sure that they're pathological. <laughs> Not funny that that word only applied to liars. Ha <laughs> ha. Um, and if they don't have enough for that, then they have to get more. And they should have an idea of my diagnosis at that time. Um, but then they're going to send it out to be tested and that takes four or five days. And I guess there are a lot of different things that could be wrong with me. Um, could be one of many different kinds of cancer, or he even said that it could be benign adenopathy, which means that there's nothing wrong with you, your lymph nodes are just swollen. So yeah, lots and lots of questions, and hopefully soon we're going to get some answers. Um, I returned to work last Friday. A big part of that is because I did not want to go on long-term disability. And the I only worked for three and a half hours, read my emails, worked on some cases, and, and did some trainings. And I was planning on going back this Thursday, but I'm gonna have the mediastinoscopy instead and take Friday off to recover, and then I'm going to go back to work next Monday. 
so that's about it for now. Hopefully I'll post something more positive tomorrow. Thanks for watching.